man, I'll bring out another video. Now, look, now today, man, I'm going to be showing you guys the most affordable team in Madden 24. So, look, we're well, not the most affordable team, but, like, some decent, affordable cards. So, look, bro, first off, they're all the affordable cards are on my team because I don't have that much coins. I have, like, 800K, but 800K is not a lot. I'm going to be honest with y'all. To build a team, 800K is not a lot. To build a team, I need at least, like, 1.5 like mil. So I just brought some cheap things. Look, everyone needs a good quarterback, but some quarterbacks could be expensive. But the best cheap quarterback in the game is probably Warren Moon, 87 overall. He, I think he costs, when I brought him, he cost 100K. But I think he only costs, like, 90K now. So he's even cheaper than he was before. He costs around 90K, I believe. And he's actually really good, to be honest. Well, for me, he's really good. I don't know about you guys. You guys are maybe different, but for me, he's actually really good. His price went up, I think. He's like 115k. Alright, but still, his card is actually really good. I would have uh, tell you to pick him up because his card is uh really good. So I'm, this video is really for like 100k budgets, low key, 100k budgets. So. If you have anything from like 100 to 150k, and you want to spend it on a card, definitely watch this vid. Uh, another player, Bo Jackson. I mean, damn, I just picked him up for 111k. Now he's on for 135. I may sell him back. Yeah, uh, Bo, he does not go for 135. And also, if you want to build his set, all you got to do is get 584s, 80, 584-85s, and it only costs like one. Maybe one like 110, maybe less to make a set. So, if you want to buy for 135, you could definitely make a set, a canvas zero set. He's a pretty good budget. Now, we come over here to receivers. The free Randy Moss you get, pick up that. That's pretty good. We'll show you two budget wide receivers you should pick up for your team. Calvin Johnson, bro, he's 6'5, 236, 88 speed, and he's only one, uh, 130k almost. Like, why would you not pick that up? Like, come on. Then, we're going to come over here. Let's hit a Tyreek Hill. I know he's not that good. I know he's not that good anymore. But if, you, if you're if you really that desperate for, like, a fast, like, you don't have a lot of coins, like, pick up Tyreek Hill. He has 86 speed, and he's only, like, 60K. 70 at the most. So, pick him up if you really, really need it. Okay, now we're going to get on to some defense. Cornerback. Pick up this Marcus Peters. Right? Like I said, they're all on my team, so I already know the players. 88 speed. I use him. He's pretty good at knockouts. Like, if it's man-to-man -man coverage, he, if you swat it, he could get some picks sometimes, too. But he's definitely a really good man-to-man -man corner. Um, if you need a zone corner, I'm sure you guys are good zone. Like, not a zone corner, but I had him on my team for a little while, but then I just sold him back. Where you at? No, 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 not a zone corner. A zone, like, not really a zone safety, but a pretty decent safety is where you at? Bam, bam, cam. I believe he's at 87. I don't have him on my team, but he's pretty decent. But yeah, bam, bam, cam. He costs us around 110. Pick him up. He's really good. I had him on my team, but then I sold him back because I brought him for, like, 90, and his price went up to, like, 120. So I just sold him back. He's pretty good, too. He could guard anything almost over the top. If I was you, I'll pick him up. So now let's hop over. I don't really feel like D line's important. Maybe middle linebacker. You could pick up uh Kyrie or this guy, but you could get him for free in the B and D packs. Like I got like a lot of those. Like let me show you the most feared 87s. They cost like 120k, but I got a lot of them for free. Like I got three of them for free. Like look. If, if I was able to sell these, I would get 360k, like about. Feel me? But I got all of them for free. They're all BNDs. So make sure you also do like the, the uh, what's it called? The field passes. They give you good free cards, like O-line. They give you good free cards. Best safety to have in the game is Eric, uh, Eric Berry, though. If you don't have the uh, stuff to buy Cam, just keep Eric Berry. Just get his team captain stuff and just max him out. It's that simple. Okay, let's get over to some middle linebackers. But like I said, Kyrie White, he, Kyrie White, he's pretty good. I have him on my team because 
I like to just pick up budget cards. I don't really pick up kicker, punter. Just pick up any really good good punter. Tight end. I don't have. I know some tight ends. It's actually two tight ends you could pick up. So it's either you could pick up that Shannon Sharp or Gronk. It's either you pick up Shannon Sharp, Gronk. If you want like a, if you want an inside receiver, like if you run a lot of PA crossers or verticals, pick up Shannon Sharp because he has good short and medium routes. But if you need like a deep ball kind of, if you need kind of like a receiver kind of tight end, I would advise you to pick up Gronk because he's 6'6", 268 pounds. He's kind of heavy, but he has one extra speed than Shannon Sharp. He does cost a little more, and but he does he's probably a better card than, than Shannon Sharp, if I'm, if I'm being honest. But like I said, it depends on your play style. If you're, if you're an inside receiver, if you're like a inside person, like, you only really throw the ball inside. This Vernon Davis is good, too. But not everybody has this kind of budget. But he's actually really kind of good. But the thing is, also, his run block isn't really that good. But Gronk has, like, an 80, I think an 88 run block. Yeah, 87 run block. So if you like to run the ball, pick him up. I mean, like I said, I just told you, it just really depends on your play style. O-line doesn't really matter. Um, the O-lineman I picked up was, I still got to pick up some more O-lineman, but I picked up this, oh, Nate Davis. I picked him up for 33K, now he's 24. Um, I got him, you could get the Jason Kelsey, pick up maybe 81s all around. I don't really care about my O-line, really, honestly. Um, then the free left us a linebacker. Uh, let me show you guys some extra corners. J.C. Horn's actually really good. Only 25k. I mean, he plays pretty good for me, honestly. 85 speed, he plays pretty good for me. He may not be as good as y'all think because of his stats, but for me, he low key plays really good. Um, but I should just get like a oh, higher overalls. I know this Pat Pete's actually really good too, but I wouldn't really pick him up, honestly. But I know that Pat Pete's really good though. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for the vid. If you guys want me to drop, like, more positions, Richard Sherman's, it's, it's high, but I'd rather pick up this Marcus Peters. If you guys want me to drop more positions, uh, let me know, honestly. Let me know if you guys want me to drop more positions, because I will. Like, if you guys want me to show, like, some... Let me, actually, let me go to some quarterbacks, because I know... Now everyone's about to have a hundred and something K, okay, so let's find some cheaper QBs. None of these QBs are really here good. Uh that Bryce Young, he's still kind of good. I think everybody has him, but he's not really that good. But now if you're on like the bigger budget kind of side and you're and you really you really want to spend all your call all your coins on one quarterback, where are you at? I would pick up this Jameis Winston. Where are you at though? Damn, does he really cost that much? Or is he at 90? Gene, okay, it's either you could pick up Gino or the James. Where is he, though? Don't pick up the Josh Allen, please. Don't. Pick up Lamar, too. Damn, where is the James Winston, bro? I know he has a card. He must not have one up on the market right now. Yeah, okay, it's a James Winston, but I just can't find it right now. Or he must not have one up on the market. Yeah, he probably doesn't have one up on the market. But if you're on, like, the higher budget kind of side, I'm going to show you guys some quarterbacks to pick up right now. Gino, he was one of the best QBs in Madden for, like, a week. And he's still really good. 300K for him isn't really a bad pass. Uh, Gino, don't pick up this Josh Allen. Very overrated card right here. For 400K, you're better... You're better off picking up Gino, which is 100k less. Trust me. Do not pick up this Josh Allen. He's overrated in real life, and he's overrated in the game. Don't pick him up. Or Lamar. But Lamar, no, nah, I wouldn't pick up Lamar. It's too pricey. Wait until next week and watch. His price is going to go to, like, maybe 450 or so. Um, That's pretty much it for today's vid. I'll see y'all boys in the next one. And peace out.